previously on Inside the Prime. The snap by Kelly, and it's a tunnel screen over on the left side, and it's caught inside the five towards the goal line. Touchdown, EMCC, and it's Patrick again. Three wide to the left, two wide to the near side, going over the middle, and it is caught by EMCC. Wide open, 10, 5, touchdown, EMCC, and that is DJ Law. Thompson with the snap, back to pass, pocket collapses, he throws it over the middle, and it's intercepted by EMCC. Inside the 20, inside the 15, inside the 10, looking for the goal line at Cinnamore, and that's his first pick six, six of the season. Touchdown, EMCC. Lone wide receiver to the far, looking near side, and firing it, caught, touchdown, EMCC. Making the reception, Cameron Myers. Middle of the field at the 25 or 24, beg your pardon, northeast over the middle, and it is caught. Touchdown, EMCC. Great concentration by DJ Law. He bobbled it once it went in his hands in the end zone, but he comes down with it. Here's the snap and looking on the screen, and it hits uh, White's hands, and it goes up in the air, and it's bobbled by EMCC, but they've got it. Running down the numbers for a sideline, going towards the end zone. 10-5, touchdown, EMCC. Demetrius Kane is second pick six of 2014. It's the second pick six of this game. Good first quarter so far. Backside pressure, now rolling to the right. Kelly's going to keep it himself, and he's going to dive over a man, or leap over a man, rather, and get uh, the first down. I think he's got it all in the far hash. Bringing a man in motion. That's Johnson from near side to far. They're going to leave it with the tailback, and he's going to come around the near side to the five. And touchdown. He's in. And EMCC will score, and that is Todd Mays. You're a good football team. Congratulations on a good ball game tonight. Wait a minute. Hey, now, 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 now. Let's make sure we get back. Let's make the corrections. And, hey, make it mean something to you to get better. Because you, you have a chance now to be very, very special. Okay? Don't waste it. What's happening with your checking account? Don't worry. With the new e-alert service from the Citizens Bank, you'll never have to think about it again. For only 99 cents per month, our e-alert service will send you a notification by email every time your debit card is used for purchases, pre-authorizations, or ATM transactions. Staying informed about your accounts can help defend you against fraud and identity theft. Call or come by the Citizens Bank today and find out how e-alert can put your mind at ease. Tune. And the win is greatness again. Man, much to be said and more to be done. Game time, another Thursday here on the gridiron, man. You know it. Time to go play. Time to go play. We here. Let's get it, baby. Let's play line football, man. Do what we do. Have a lot of fun tonight. Dominate the football game. You with me? Dominate on three. One, two, three. Dominate. Here in Fulton, as he sent the Indians to victory over EMCC. The kick is in the air. Stagger's going to take it at the goal line. Come to the near hash. Get across the 10. 15, 20. Has a little bit of running room, and he's going to run into traffic around the 29-yard line, and he's going to be tackled there. Ball will be on the far hash. Spotted the football around the 33. Second and six. Back to pass, and it's a crossing route. Caught underneath by EMCC. First down and more. Middle of the field. Now it goes uh, down the far hash. He's got a seam, and he's going to be tackled around the 30-yard line. And EMCC Cameron with Cameron Myers. Myers making that reception. Kelly in the shotgun with four wide. Baker to his right will take the snap. And he swings it to Baker around the right side. And Baker going towards the uh, first down sticks is going to be uh, inside the 25-yard line. Gain of three, fourth and three. Back to pass. Preston Baker wide open in the flat near side. 15-10. And he's going to be drugged down from behind around the five-yard line. Kelly in the shotgun trips to the near side. Back to pass. Pocket collapses. Fires it towards the goal line. The pylon. And it is caught. Touchdown. EMCC. And the Lions are on the board. Six to nothing. Everything's exactly the same. Let's go, baby. Go back. 
The snap is at the knees and it's picked up and he is going to be hit and dropped inside the 30 down to the 29 yard line. Belton goes down. So it's a possession play, ball spotted middle of the field. Belton will take the snap and he uh, gets scared, runs up the middle and he's going to get the first down. He gets out across the 40 up to the 41. I thought he panicked just a little bit but did a good job of carrying the football. They'll snap it from the 34, stepping up to the 23 and kicking it. It's a booming high, kind of a wobbly punt. Angling to the far hash, taking it at the 25 is Patrick. He has room to run, cross 35, 40, down the far sideline, has some blocks. He's at the 40, to the 30, 25, 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown, EMCC. Cammy on Patrick, taking it 75 yards for the score. Special teams have played well all year, and. Uh... You know, we had a chance, and this is really the first game that we had a guy that actually punted to us. Patrick back deep to receive. He's around the 11. Here's the snap, and it's returnable. He takes it at the 11 as Patrick comes near side at the 20. 25, 30, 40, down the near sideline. Has a couple of men to beat, and they're going to hit him and stop him around the 40. He drags him a couple of more yards inside the 40-yard line, and Camion Patrick has had an outstanding night returning punts. McCorley trips near side, which is the wide side of the field, and a backside pressure, and Belton's going to be sandwiched. He's hit, and he's dropped inside the 25 down to around the 24-yard line. Marco Montgomery comes in. All on the far hash, EMCC showing pressure. Now they back up. Belton, back deep to pass. He's dancing, dancing. He's running scared now, and he's going to be hit, and he is going to be sandwiched and dropped inside the 15-yard line. He's got antsy feet, folks. Here's the snap. They fake the give, looking towards the right sideline, going down the right sideline, has a man open, and he catches it in the end zone, bobbles it, but touchdown, EMCC. Oh, goodness, great concentration. By the wide receiver, looks like that one is Brandon Acker. We're going in trips a lot, and uh, Chad been telling me how we were going to try to, you know, beat them deep. And, uh, so I kind of knew what was coming, so I tried to, you know, get behind the corner right there, and we just tried to make a play on the ball. It turned out good. Here's the snap. They're going to leave it up the middle. McCorley's going to be met at the backfield, and he's going to be dropped. And he's dropped back at the 14-yard line, loss of two, or excuse me, a 3-4 lineman, I beg your pardon. Kelly in the shotgun. Snap of the football, looking left, and it's a, a slant, and it's caught. And out across the 40-yard line, up to around the 42-yard line, EMCC's uh, Desmond Goss, the far. Kelly inside the 40 will take the snap. Back to pass and fires it near side, and it is caught by Revis. And Revis down the near sideline is going to get inside ICC territory down to the 48 yard line. Looking towards the left, Kelly now looking over the middle of the field, and it's caught by Staggers at the 40, still running inside the 35, and he's going to be knocked off his feet around the 31 yard line. First down, EMCC. And Kelly, ball near hash, snap. We'll leave it with Baker. Baker goes around left end. He's going to have the first down as he uh, breaks one tackle, breaks another inside the 20 yard line, and he's going to get close to the 15 down around the Looks like possibly the 17-yard line. Preston Baker moves the chains. Holden stands in the shotgun. He'll take the snap, and it's a quarterback draw, and he's going to be hit, and he is dropped around the 9-yard line. The snap, he play action to air, and he tries to go up the middle. He's going to lose yardage uh, back inside the 25-yard line. Oh, spot of the football just over the 25-yard line of EMCC. The snap by Belton. He's back to pass. Inside pressure. He escapes it. Rolls to the near side. He's inside the 25, inside the 20, and he's going to have enough for a first down. CC. The snap to Belton. Here comes the house, and it's a high screen, a little arching screen, and it's caught. And close to the first down, spinning around the 10-yard line is the uh, receiver, which is McCorley out of the backfield. In an odd formation in the backfield, the snap, Belton is going to uh, give it on the inside handoff, and it's going to be a first down inside the 10-yard line. And they're going to spot it around the uh, 7. Five wide on second and goal to go from the 16 and sandwiched and dropped back at the 17 yard line sacked and a loss of one Belton goes down long of the season if he can connect will await the snap here it is the hold the kick and it is I think okay. wide left yes it is wide left and it is incomplete and EMCC holds with 1.57 to go before half it left to right they're ready to snap it again here's Kelly looking near side and now fires it towards the sideline and it's caught and over into ICC territory Cameron Myers Alliance on the move four wide Kelly with a snap Inside handoff to Baker. Baker has a lane, breaks a couple of tackles, just tough running down to the 35-yard line. Up by three touchdowns, 21-0. The snap on first down from the ICC 30, firing it near side, and it is caught around the 16-yard line by Brandon Acker. Five wide, Kelly in the shotgun. Surveys the defense, takes the snap, quarterback draw, and now he bounces to the near side. He is going to be at the 6-yard line, 11-yard line, a bigger part. It's good for two for two this season. Here's the kick. It's end over end, and it is through the uprights and good.
Here's the snap, back to pass. And rolling to the near side and coming up around the 35, which is the line of scrimmage, and hit there and stopped. And so EMCC here in the third quarter, spotted the football left hash. The snap, Kelly leaves it with Baker. Baker has room coming around near side, now cuts between the numbers and the hash and then falls around the 40-yard line, maybe to the 39. Everything is ready for go. The snap from the 40 of ICC, and it's caught. Short pass on the far side, breaking a couple of tackles inside the 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown, EMCC. Camion Patrick. Patrick with a touchdown reception. For ICC as they have it at midfield, the snap, play action, and pocket collapses and he's going to be dropped and sacked around the 41-yard line. And that'll bring up fourth down. Four wide, two to either side, Mays will stand to the right of Kelly, who's back to pass and fires it on the swing pass to Kelly near side. Kelly jukes a man out of his shoes and gets out across the 40 and he's up to the 43 and hit forward towards the 45-yard line. First down, 10 to go, ICC territory. Kelly, back to pass, great protection, fires it deep down the near sideline, has Myers caught it at the 15, and he is going to go out of bounds inside the 10-yard line. I mean, he's like a Taewon Austin out there. He can make plays, uh, he can do a lot of stuff, and I'm just happy that he's on my team. <laughs> Left, two wide receivers near side, empty backfield, snap from the 11, back to pass, fade pattern all alone, caught Cameron Myers, touchdown, EMCC. 4.05 to go in the third. With that play, we, he called my number. There was nobody holding me, so it was a wide open charge, he threw it up, and it was just an easy catch for me. Here's the snap, leaves it with McCarley. He goes up the middle, he's hit hard, and he's dropped. But McCarley to his right. Everybody goes out for the pass, back to pass, firing it deep over the middle, and it is intercepted by EMCC at the five-yard line. Coming out across 10, 15, putting on the burners, 30, 35, 40, and he is going to go. Quan Latham, 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown. Another pick six for EMCC. And the Lions celebrate the back corner of the end zone on the far side. They're all jumping up and piling on Quan Latham. Other one. It's at the 41 at Baker Park. Here's the snap and hit in the backfield, dropped around the 39 yard line. That's going to be another tackle in the backfield. Mays with the snap and he fires it to Law who just carried it just a moment ago and leaps over a man for a first down. Oh my goodness. And he gets out across the 45 up to about the 48. He leaped about five feet in the air or higher. So from close to the 26, second and 17, the snap. May looks near side, now fires, has a man open, and it is caught at the 15 and going inside the 10 and bowling down to the six yard line. Snap for the near hash. It's a quarterback draw all the way. Going up the middle is Mays, and he gets to the goal line and scores. He's hit when he reaches the goal line, but he is going to cross it and score. And EMCC has scored over 50 points. Now, tied to Mays. They here right there. Take a good look at his face, man. You, know, you, know, you blank your eye, he's gone. The EMCC runs to 5 0. Oh. They have won 17 straight. The Lions are 3 0 in the North Division. They dismantle ICC 51 to nothing here in Fulton. We went a little through a little rough patches, you know, but at the end we got it all all together and figured out everything. We got everything clicking. Oh, uh, we played good. Uh, we made some mistakes, but there's always room for, for improvement. So you just got to build, uh, review the film, and just uh, keep on working. So over our game, we played a little sloppy, but I, we're gonna we're gonna come back next week. Coach explained it to us um, earlier before we came out. You got to play with a lot of heart and enthusiasm in this game because it's a big rival game and you know everybody coming out here and everybody coming out here with a lot of fire and intensity. So, you know, a big game like this, you got to come out here with a lot of heart. This is just the next win. We're 1-0. We're happy with that. Now we want to be 1-0 after the next week. Remember Hunter. We'll remember Nate. Okay. Guys, great job of executing. Great job of coming in and finishing up. Okay. I know I had, I, I was about to have a conniption, but I want you to be perfect. You're not, hey, we're never going to be perfect, but I want you to work for it, okay? All right, we good?
Do you have the money you need for a world-class college education? Did you just graduate from one of our district high schools? Do you live in one of our six counties? If the answer is yes, did you know that EMCC offers financial assistance through our tuition guarantee program to those who qualify? To learn more, visit eastms.edu. East Mississippi Community College. Start here, go anywhere. Allison Moore, defense back, Law High School, Law Mississippi. My game face. Coming out of high school, um, he was a kid who took back um, a lot of punts, uh, great ball skills, and uh, I kind of, kind of saw that as being something that I could use to turn into making him a great defensive back with his ball skills. I was recruited by a couple of JUCOs. I never had, I didn't have any, any D1 offers, but I had um, chose East Mississippi. I knew they had the best academic plan for me. It was a 2012 sign. He, uh, he actually uh, left school because he had some family problems. He had to go home and help his mom and all that. He returned in 2012, 2013, and uh, I knew he had all the tools. Uh, we had just lost two uh, all SEC safeties, which he was behind, and uh, which uh, Shaquille Fluke and Justin Cox both signed Division One SEC guys. Uh, and he, he he stepped in and made an immediate uh, impact, uh, and really I, I picked up right where them guys left off. Uh, and the nine interception was kind of a surprise, but anybody who catch nine interception, uh, they gonna catch the eye of a recruiter, and uh, you know, and that's what he did. You know, as a young man, you gotta do what you gotta do. You know, financial wise, mom's struggling. I, I'm the older brother in the house, really the man of the house, so I had to go home and help my mom and my little brother. You know, I don't like to see him down. I hate to see him down. And then when he when he came back after you know the fall that he left when he came back in that spring, he I think he kind of got it then that you know I mean coaches started talking about him and he kind of started getting accolades on the field that next fall and um, academically he was doing okay he wasn't you know I mean he was he was holding his own academically and I think he just kind of started finding his place here and really realizing that he could do this. Um, and he could do it academically, but he could also do it athletically. High school, I took it for granted. I really wasn't paying attention. I came up here, I realized what I had. I had to start paying attention in class, learn a little more, stay focused. School is the right place to stay focused, man. School, it'll get you focused. Um, and then as time kept progressing and the more, the better he played and the better he would do in the classroom, they, they kind of coincided to where I think now, you know, he's, a, he's confident and he knows that he knows that he can do it. Academically, he can do it. He's proven that. Um, he's, you know, basically one class away from graduating from here with, a, with eligibility to play Division I football, which is something that I don't think he ever thought he could accomplish. He's a competitor. He, uh... He don't like to lose, um, don't matter which drill. If it's a drill we doing, and, and he, he can kind of tell by my demeanor, um, I don't really have to get on to him. He know once my demeanor change, that it's serious. Okay, we need to we need to compete in this drill, and he get the rest of the guys going. Oh, he don't have to get on to me that much. Not that much, <laughs> not on the field, not at all. You know, I'm gonna do what I gotta do. Oh, that's a great coach, man. He fun, fun to be around. I like to have fun, I like to get out there. That's, that's my guy. That's my guy there. We talk a lot, make sure I do the right things. Stay, keep my head on right. Give me where I gotta go. He don't say a whole lot as far as, but when he does speak, uh, they listen to him. He's a, he's a leader like that. They take him very seriously. I mean, he jokes around with a lot of guys, but when it's when it's time to go get it, he go get it. He's just an honest, this is what this is me, this is what you get type of kid, and, and that's how he is in the classroom, which a lot of teachers appreciate that. You know, we would rather you say, hey, I don't know how to do this at all, 
can you help me then act like you've got it and then next thing you know you know you're flunking out so um, he's a really hard worker in the classroom right now he's battling a math class but he comes in here for tutoring and he does everything he's supposed to do and that's all you can ask you know of of um, anybody is to give it your all and then we'll deal with you know we'll deal with what that brings um, when we get the grade but as long as you're giving it your all and you're doing your best and you're working hard at it I mean I can, you know then then that's all I can ask of him or anybody he will play in the SEC somewhere if he chooses to uh, and he will do good um, just because he's a competitor I know what he's gonna do once he get on the field anywhere in the country uh, and he's, he's gonna compete each and every day for a starting spot he's really in good shape academically for a division one scholarship you know, which again is an amazing thing for a kid that I don't think he even thought he could do it coming in. Last year you, I, I believe I want to say you led the nation with nine interceptions yes, sir. last year. Uh, just just talk about that that achievement right there for you. Just uh, talk about that. I mean, I ain't going to take all the credit. I had, I had help from the D-line, giving pressure on the quarterback. Linebackers making them throw it over top. Therefore, I'd be in my position to go get the ball. But like I say, I just, the ball loves me. I love the ball. I got to be around it. If it's in the air, I'm going to get it. This is one of them guys, this is the kind of guy you want to coach every game. That you wish you had all 11 guys just like him because he's the type of player. If he mess up, he going to know his mistakes, but he's going to also come back and tell you, Coach, we got this. And anytime you got a kid or a player, they can come tell you that we got this and they're going to go out there and bag it up. You, you, them the kind of guys you want to coach. What are you looking at uh, as for a major for a career after football? Probably physical therapist. Maybe I own my own business. Mm -hmm. That's what I like to do. I like to be in control. I like to lead. I stay working with the athletes. Uh, I, I like that. Be around athletes and bring back memories so I can tell them what I've done. You know? Nine yeah. interceptions in one season? Yeah, nine interceptions in one season. I don't send them more than that. <laughs> oh, right here. Look here. Look here. The one and only. Trouble Number man. nine. Ellen Summer. You gotta do it like this, man. <laughs>
y'all some nice floats. Nice floats. Nice floats. So that's good. Beautiful girls. All these little kids were wonderful. All right. See, that's good. <laughs> wonderful right there. So, hey, you heard it from the judges right here. If you weren't here, you missed it. They said it was a great parade, so that's all that matters. They tallying up the score right now. We're going to know who won. Hey, it's a great day to be a lion, I tell you, ladies and gentlemen. A great day. Let's go. Who the rest of Yeah, yeah.